Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Former 90 Day Fiancé cast member Paul Steele is revealing what his relationship with Karee Martins is after revealing she is pregnant. Paul from Kentucky had met Kareen from Brazil online and went to see her in person on before the 90 Days season 1. Their age gap, cultural differences, and trust issues made Paul and Kareen a bad match, and it didn't take long for the relationship to go downhill. Paul already had a criminal history, while Kareen allegedly got physical with Paul in front of their children, leading them to split and lose custody of Pierre and Ethan. Paul from 90 Day Fiancé loves to create confusion about his relationship with Kareen on social media. This time, his update is even more shocking. 90 Day Fiancé blogger Shabuti shared a screenshot of an update from Paul on OnLifeEnds, where he is revealing that Kareen is pregnant. Yes, me and Kareen are still married, Paul added. According to Paul, Kareen has a new boyfriend, the baby's father. He alleged that Kareen's new boyfriend doesn't want her to be filming any adult content anymore, and that she is having problems with immigration. Paul assured his subscribers that Kareen would provide him with any content she has already filmed, and he would post it when he has time. Paul further claimed that Kareen had an intrauterine device inserted into the uterus to prevent pregnancy. He believes that Kareen's boyfriend convinced her to remove the device, so she became pregnant immediately. Paul was still trying to mentally absorb all the information. He claimed that Kareen's new boyfriend allegedly told her that he was 50 years old and that he really wanted a baby. He added that Kareen had met the man this year. Earlier this year, Paul had claimed that Kareen was married to a new man. He had congratulated Kareen and someone named Jonathan M. Roof on their wedding. Paul was accused of hacking Kareen's Instagram and posting custody documents with a positive result of an STD test. By March 2024, Paul had spread rumors of Kareen being pregnant. He posted several screenshots of an unverified Facebook conversation between Kareen and someone named Michael. The messages showed Kareen allegedly claiming she had done a test and was thanking Michael for removing her IUD. The messages had Kareen and Michael making plans to get married and move in together. Kareen later proved that the messages were untrue. She said she was hacked by Paul and that she wasn't pregnant. She claimed it was Paul who had posted the messages using her Facebook and that he was a dangerous man. The incident and Paul's new post about Kareen bear a lot of similarities. Paul probably made up a fake pregnancy story about Kareen which then, Kareen will claim is a lie. It won't be surprising if it's Paul who operates both his and Kareen's social media profiles and creates such online drama from time to time to get attention and divert possible clients to the couple's adult content page. Paul's 90-day fiancé career ended long ago, but it's incidents like these which remind fans why she's one of the worst cast members the franchise has seen.